In this video, we'll be installing a sub feed lug kit onto a 225 amp NQ panel board. The first step will be to remove the main lugs one per phase on the NQ panel board. Next, we'll install the phase barriers, one on A phase and one on C phase. These install by hooking over the end cap, rotating down, and snapping into place. Next, we'll install the safety lugs. We'll be utilizing the hardware out of the hardware bag assembly. And inside the bag assembly, there's a hardware card. The hardware card contains six screws, two per face, and one screw for the neutral. And it also contains the information required for the torque for each connection. Next, we'll install the second neutral lug. The hardware for that is also on the hardware card. Next, using a torque wrench, we'll tighten each connection to the proper torque as specified on the hardware card. Next, we'll be installing the rail extensions. We'll install the splice first. The splice has a lance on the side of it that engages into an opening in the side of the rail. The next step in the process will be to modify the dead front assembly by adding a 6 inch dead front extension to the dead front assembly. We'll remove the lug cover from the line end of the panel board. 